Hello guys, here is a video in that I create a low poly game asset with Blender that I will use in my Unity low poly game kit. The model will be a wooden grade and for this video I won't explain every step that I do because it's all one concept. I add cubes, then go to edit mode to move, scale and rotate the parts. I have my screencast keys enabled so that you can see which keys I'm actually pressing, so you should be able to follow along easily. Another important feature that I use is snapping. Most of the time I select parts of the mesh by pressing the L key, which selects separated geometry even if it belongs to the same object. And then I hold the Ctrl key pressed which enables snapping to move either the whole selected mesh or single selected faces till they snap to other edges of the model and this is basically how I build up the whole thing. So this is the basic shape, a wooden lath that I will duplicate often. And here I make use of the array modifier to duplicate this. So this will be the bottom of the grate. And now I'll bring this here to the center. Okay, then I will apply the modifier and after that it will be a similar task for every wood part. I will select it rotate it and move it to a position where it fits. Here I select with L, then duplicate it, rotate around the Y axis in this case 90 degrees. You just type R, Y and then 90. And then I move it with snapping enabled. So now it has the correct position, then I duplicate this part and move it upwards. Okay, I will speed up here a little bit, because this is all very similar. I duplicate parts and move them with snapping enabled. For the inner corners of the grate I add thicker wood parts, also cubes, but I remove the face that won't be visible. So I delete one face of the cube and then I rotate it 180 degrees. Ok, then I duplicate this part and move it to the corners. Now we finish the basic model, I assign my material and then I switch to edit mode and unwrap it by pressing U and reset. Then I select the UV islands and scale them down and then I press G to move them to a brown color. This is the texturing method that I already explained in previous tutorials for low poly texturing. Now I duplicate the bottom of the crate and move it upwards. And then I press P key to separate this part because it has to be a separate object that will be animated. I will animate this in the next tutorial. We will add an open crate animation. Alright, the top part is also finished here, then I set the pivot point, the origin for the top part, to a position at the back side. Just set the 3D cursor and then press Ctrl, Alt, Shift and C and set origin to 3D cursor. And now it's possible to rotate the top part here in this case around the Y axis and I will use this in the next video when I add the open animation to the asset. And this is how it looks like in material mode. You can already see the texture. But the top part is a bit too small, so I will scale it up and apply the scale afterwards.
This looks good to me. Now let's rotate it again. Yeah, nice. Now I'm going to move the model to the first layer, just to see how it will come out in the nature environment. Okay, pretty cool. Now let's export the crate. And be sure to have both objects selected, then open File, Export, FBX. The selected objects only, and just the mesh. I'm exporting directly into my Unity Projects folder, and when I open up Unity with the Low Poly Game Kit, the new object is imported and I can drag it into the scene. And here you can see that the pivot point of the top part is set correctly. We can open it like this by rotating the top part. So I'm quite happy with the model and as I said in the next video I will add an open animation with Blender and then add the possibility to let the player in Unity interact with the asset. The game kit can be downloaded from the Unity Asset Store for free, I want to keep it available for free and you can help this game kit grow by supporting me on my Patreon. Thanks for watching guys, thanks for your support, don't forget to subscribe and see you soon here on JNM.